Oh, we have a carrot for Rose Stone. Look at how freaking adorable that is. What do you think about that, Rose Stone? Yes, she found it delicious. Oh, you guys. Look at that. We're growing closer with her. Oh, I wonder if we can actually... <gasps> Acquainted? Oh my gosh, the mounted attack together? Settle up for an attack with added horsepower and likely more damage. Oh my gosh, you guys! We can actually do like attacks with Rose Stone. This is so cool. And hello everyone and welcome back to Metopia, where I have been hard at work with our little me's. Oh my gosh, this has been so much fun. So we just found Rose Stone last time and we're getting ready to go confront the serious soldier, Zuko, to see if he's finally going to let us into the castle. But while we were trying to get ready to go to the castle, I ended up finally figuring out how we can actually edit up some of our appearances on our team. Thank you guys very much for your tips about that. It took me a little while to implement them, but they are here now. And actually, if we come and we look at our little party now, let me see how everybody is doing. If we look at our little party now, we actually have changed the appearances on many of the weapons. So look at Chips. I went ahead and I gave him a wig that looks like his real hair because he has been letting it grow. So it's definitely like guinea pig all over the place and freaking adorable. So he looks a little bit more like his real self. And thank you guys so much for teaching me how to go ahead and change the appearance of the weapons while they can still keep the stats of the better weapons. So Chips has his little bee sword back again. We still haven't found out his favorite food and apparently finding out their war cries, which is something I passed up on, is something that you can do with all of them. So we're definitely going to try to find like a cool war cry for everybody. And then we've also got Lily. She has now got her helm, her favorite helm, the traditional knight helm, and she has got her favorite sword now. And you can see she has her favorite food, the butterfly honey, which we will try to get more of for her. And Lily has actually been very busy going out and about using all of those game tokens up so that we could try to like go to the little arcade and we could try to get hopefully the really nice armor that Lily heard rumors of. Since we're saying anytime she goes to the arcade to spin the little like roulette wheel she's actually investigating the local area around the inn and trying to find like resources in the villages the inns are in and this time I spent like 10 of these arcade tickets having her go out again and again and again and the only thing she found guys was bananas so we have like nine HP bananas now. So everybody on the team should be happy because we had plenty of bananas. And she also got several outing tickets. Um, It doesn't look like to anywhere new, but we might have her maybe go to the cinema with somebody just to celebrate all of the outing tickets that she got. And while we were out and about, Tate actually went with her because we're gonna try to sneak into the castle now after all. And Tate is temporarily dressed in his undercover outfit. He, he's a little shy, but he's also a little sneaky, and he tries to find ways to help his sister Lily out by sneaking around, and people totally ignore janitors, so he dressed as like a little janitor who just sort of is sweeping in the corners and listening for all of the secrets of what lies around. He is our cautious mage, after all, uh, and he kind of tries to keep secret when he's on those little missions with Lily that he's actually a mage who is learning how to do better and better magic and I think that's just freaking adorable look at him oh my gosh but after we get in the castle we'll change him back into his normal outfit for sure and you can also see that his favorite food is goblin ham do I have a favorite food yet <gasps> rose stone oh my favorite food's cotton candy oh that's adorable in real life I'm kind of impartial to cotton candy and sugar as a whole but that's okay my favorite food in real life is definitely oranges but all right so I actually want to go ahead who wants to spend money on what? What am I dreaming of? I'm dreaming of the frilly uniform. I am kind of squishy. So now that I know how we can actually... I'm going to go ahead and let her buy it. Yay! Good job, little Mimi! All right. And then I'm actually... Oh, it's kind of cute. But... So we can equip it, but we're only going to equip the stats, which apparently is what that button that's been there the whole time means. Cough, cough. So we'll do that. And I still can keep my look. Yay! 
And we have plenty of HP bananas. I don't know why you two have bananas on the brain. Oh my gosh. And then let me see if I can actually get the team. Can I get Tate hanging out? There we go with chips. Is that maybe I could hang out with Lily for a second? Let's see. Let's send Lily to the cinema because she got so many free tickets to the cinema and bananas while she was really trying to find out more secrets to the castle. And then let's have her actually go and we'll see who she takes. Will she take me because we're in the same room? <gasps> she took me! We're gonna go see a movie together! Or if I want to like roleplay this a little bit, I'm gonna say we're gonna see like a, a theater performance or like jugglers or something. Okay, this is so freaking cute. I heard something wild about this movie. <gasps> Cooking Mama is here and Female Villager! Oh my gosh, and Iroh! And look, there's Meowth! I totally missed out on whatever the juicy gossip was about the movie because I was so excited to see. Look, Cooking Mama's in the background and she's dressed so freaking adorable. Oh my goodness, and I, I have no idea what Amis are talking about, but I hope they're having a good time. Yay, we're growing closer! Oh, that's so cute! Heck, I love this! <gasps> now we're acquainted! Okay, so all I have to do is just like throw them into a room together and then send them out on- <gasps> Devil's food cake! We got a little grub to be able to eat! Like, we definitely don't have enough grub. Oh my gosh. Okay, so that's how you can really start building up all of the members of the team. You know what? We're gonna go ahead and have Chips and Lily kind of get acquainted because they don't really know anything about each other. And can I send my- whoops. Can I send myself, like, to the movies with a horse? Is that something that can happen? <laughs> Alright, let's send them out. We'll go really fast this time. They're gonna go to a movie! All right, Chip seems to be having a good time. We're actually gonna say that these two are patrolling the area, trying to get into the castle. <laughs> oh my gosh, look, there's Flick. <gasps> look, there's Piranha Plant and Shy Guy. There's Flick from the latest Animal Crossing New Horizons and Meringue. And Chip slept through the whole movie. He, he actually really hates movies in real life. We've never gone to a theater together to see a movie. We've been together eight years and married for a year and I have legitimately never seen a movie with my husband in the theater. Like at any point from when we're dating, after we're married, never happened. But it looks like she doesn't mind that Chip slept through the whole thing. There we go, another acquainted! Good! Okay, it's important for everybody to like have a bit of a relationship with each other. And they brought home some banshee deers! I totally forgot about the fact like that we really need to get everybody feeling pretty good. And Tate's really shy and he only knows his sister. Hmm. But I'm actually gonna see if he and Rose Stone can spend a little time together somehow. Can I send him and Rose Stone like on a wa fishing? He loves fishing. Tate, can you go fishing with Rose Stone? Is that like a thing? No, he's taking somebody. Hey, he's taking me! Okay. All right, I'm bored. No, I'm never bored. That's one of my secret superpowers. I'm always so fascinated by the world, I'm never bored. Plus, look at this, look how pretty it is. How could you get bored of this? You must clear your mind. Oh, I love my wig, it's so cool. All right, what are we gonna get? Oh my gosh, we both fell asleep. And we got really close, so we went all the way up to level three. Yes, and we learned warning and show off together, so we really enjoyed that outing. That was precious. And we brought home some MP sweets. All right, so I don't know how you really, I guess you have to like sleep with the horse in the stable to spend time with the horse, but we'll figure out how that's going to work in the future. Um, and I think we'll go ahead and set off now. I kind of want to feed everybody. It's so cute, everything's so cute, but I, I need to get moving. All right, come on, Rose Stone. We're going on some adventures. Gosh. It's all just so cute. Dear Siri, I have so many worries at night, I just can't sleep. And since I can't sleep, I'm writing this letter from Helen. Oh, Helen, at least you have your face back. Oh, she gave us a lot of outing tickets. Well, all right, it is finally time. Let's go ahead and now that we have scouted around the castle and gathered up a lot of bananas, but unfortunately no concrete way of sneaking in, we're going to face down Zuko once more. Oh, I love this. This is so cute. So cute. All right, Zuko. We've had enough of your seriousness. I don't have the avatar. 
But I have an invitation from the mayor. You are approaching Greenhorn Castle. I'm sorry, but I can't. Dun dun dun. Oh, you have a letter of introduction from the mayor. My apologies. Go right ahead. We're in! Finally! Yay! Alright guys, so let's see what's going on inside the castle. Octavian is waiting for us after all. Go, go, go! Yay! Head for the inn! Wait, there's an inn in the castle? Maybe we're just gonna try to go inside the castle. Wow, I can see the castle! I've never seen it up close before. I wonder if there's a princess living in there. Nah, princesses are always in another castle. <laughs> All right, the onward team. Did... Oh my goodness! All right, so we need to pick a direction to go. Game tickets and lev le lever. Lever. Hmm. Lever. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna go towards the lever because I have a feeling. I mean, I wonder if that was actually labeled. Everyone's feeling good. Tate would be the one to push it. What's this? Found an odd lever. Uh, pull it. I'm sure that's fine. He is, he would be the one to get us in trouble. Hey, sweet! Now we've got access to like a hidden path and a treasure chest. Good job, Tate. Maybe there's something inside there for him. Maybe he stumbled upon something since he actually any of our food lying around. Maybe he stumbled upon something since he was the one who was actually like going around looking for secrets for his sister Lily too. <gasps> Butterflies, Lily! Lily, I might be able to get you some dinner! And Tate's gonna show off! Wow, that was really amazing, Tate. That was a big show off, actually. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and try to show off a little bit too. Look at the goblin. The goblin now is like, I don't know about this. Um, but let's actually, whoops, not home cooking. Flambe this rock moth. With donuts of justice! Oh, Chips and I are gonna do it! We're gonna get Lily some food! Smack! Alright, and Lily finished. Rosestone's having a good time. I wonder if she's trying to figure out, like, how this works. Yes! Butterfly honey! And goblin ham! Oh, actually, the goblins are perfect for Tate, because he loves the goblin ham. Alright, come along, team! What? Again? All right, we've got this, friends. Oh, not Banshees again. All right. Oh my gosh, Tate, that was so good. Oh, Chips. He's watching after me after I got whopped. And actually, the whole team working together by building up friendships would be great. <gasps> Rosestone, are you gonna do something? Oh my gosh, Rosestone. Mounted attack. Saddle up for an attack with added damage. Horsepower, uh, or with added horsepower, um, likely more damage. All right, you know what? These Banshees are just jealous of my hair, so we're gonna get them again. All right, end the battle, Rosestone. Hi-ho, Cherio. Though a lot of you guys probably have no idea what that means. All right. Good job, Lily. She's really strong, too. Does Rosestone level up from that, too? Because, like, Rosestone helped out. She should get some levels. We collected more Banshee tears. We're unstoppable, team! Alright, and we'll jog our way into the little inn. Excellent. Hey, guide! Oh, Tate's spending the night curled up with Rosestone. Let's see. So, are, is Tate and Rosestone getting closer? Huh. Not really. I need everybody to start getting a little bit closer. Tate, come on. You're supposed to bond with the horse. Alright. Can we go to any unique places? No. What about the arcade? Anything super special in here? A ragged robe? Alright. We're gonna go ahead. Oh, and goblin ham. Okay. We're gonna study around this inn. Lily is going to get in investigate around this inn. <gasps> and we just got what is probably a better outfit. For Tate! Oh my gosh, it's so beat up. <laughs> oh, Tate. Oh my gosh, so actually it's completely beat up and destroyed. Um, I gave it to him. I guess, you know what, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna have him actually wear that. But I'm gonna see if we can try to get oh, an MP candy. All right, well, there go our game tickets. That was Lily's attempts to try to figure out things that are happening in the area. That was freaking adorable. 
Um, poor Tate. You know what, though? I'm actually gonna come over. Oops, not Lily. And we're actually gonna change Tate's, like, appearance so that now he has that ragged robe. Because why not? His, his sister found it for him, and we're gonna say that it's actually in an abandoned tower. Here in, we're gonna edit appearance of the hat again. Let's see, and what kind of hat should we give him? Clown hat, he's also got the ragged robe hat. <laughs> Oh my goodness, he's so cute in that. We're gonna go ahead and definitely leave him with this. But I'm gonna say that he gets this outfit because it actually belonged to a powerful wizard. And we found the wizard's abandoned tower on the castle and Lily like snatched this for him, thinking maybe it would have great power. And actually it doesn't have very good power, but Tate's too kind to of his sister let him to let her know that. All right, so let's see. I feel like, uh, what do we wanna spend our gold on now? But me, you just got some new stuff. Newsprint uniform. That's kind of cute too. But you're gonna have to think about it, little me, because we're actually doing really good. All right, let's do, let's do one more outing. We're gonna do a little seaside walk for the first time with Tate and we'll see who he takes. Oh, I think I can actually pick who, who he takes. If I, like, push things around a little bit more, I'll investigate that. And then we'll kind of just get a good view of the sea from the- Oh, look at how cute this is! Warm-up time! <laughs> and we'll get a nice little view of the sea before we get ready to go further into the castle. I am just having way too much fun just spending time with my Mies and watching their little relationships. <gasps> Cotton candy! Okay, that's it! We're gonna wrap up with dinner tonight because I think we have everybody's favorite foods, more or less. There's cotton candy for me, there's butterfly honey for Lily, and then there's goblin ham for Tate. So we'll go ahead. Tate's gonna get himself some goblin ham, super delicious. He's so happy, look at that. And then we'll go ahead and give Lily the butterfly honey, which I think she loves. Yes, look at that. So she's super, super happy. We'll give her both of them, because why not? She's been working really hard for us, gathering all of the little evidence around the inns. And then let's go ahead and we're gonna try Devil's Food Cake for chips. It looks like chocolate cake and he loves that in real life. He's content, finally! He's such a picky eater as his little me. And some cotton candy for me, oh yeah. But there we go, you guys. Man, I wish we could actually give Rose Stone something too because it would be really great to feed her. But all right, next time I swear we will set off and we will actually investigate what's going on in the castle. I'm just having so much fun with my little team. It's adorable. And thank you guys so much for joining me. If you guys could, do please leave a like for all of the amazing bananas, I guess, that Lily has found. And if you would like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But most importantly, my friends, stay curious, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!